having a sunroom can enhance any home. So I got to visit Four Seasons Sunrooms and learn the benefits of having a glass addition on your home. Hey guys, we're here with Matt from Four Seasons Sunrooms and we're gonna learn why we need a sunroom in our home. So Matt, how are you? I'm great, Mark. Thanks for having me, man. So talk to me about what's the difference between an addition and a sunroom. Okay, the big difference is the amount of glass you're gonna have in this room. The amount of natural light that you get from a sunroom or a solarium as opposed to a regular it's addition. it's all glass, right? Exactly, exactly. A lot of homeowners have concerns when they're adding additional space is how dark is my kitchen gonna get? How dark is my family room gonna get? With a sunroom or an all glass room, you don't just have that issue. Yeah, totally, it's awesome. Some people might be concerned about the glass part of it, right? Is it gonna get really hot during summer or is it gonna get really cold during winter? Talk to me about that. Great question. And that's, you know, traditional sunrooms have that misconception where it's too hot, too cold. Yeah. And really in choosing the right product is having the right glass. Yeah. If 90% of this room is gonna be glass, that's your most important feature. Yes. You know, what kind of glass is it? And there are different types of glass out there that reflect heat, reflect okay. UV, and make this room comfortable year round. What type of glass am I looking for? Yeah, uh, essentially something that has very high reflective uh, heat cane. Because I'm always concerned, if I'm looking at a sunroom, um, you know, is it gonna get really, really cold during winter and is it gonna get really hot during summer, right? Because it's all glass. You know what, 80% of sunrooms out there, too hot, too cold. Yep. So do your research, but there's really awesome sunrooms and solariums out there that make it comfortable year round. Like Four Seasons? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so talk about renovate versus relocate, because that's always a really big question for people. Yeah, it's it's huge. I mean, moving is, is a big, big undertaking. You know, it's yeah. expensive, you're usually moving up. Yeah. Uh, with the prices in the GTA, and, it's, it's, you know. And not just that, like people love the neighborhood as well. You know, if yeah. you've been there for a long time, some people are like, I'd rather renovate it and add an addition, right? Yeah, yeah. And that's what happens. You know what, when you move, chances are you're going to want to change something in that house anyways. Yeah, exactly. And if you've been there for a while, you've already done certain upgrades that you're comfortable with, why not, you know, increase the value and stay where you are and build something really awesome. Like a sunroom. Exactly. Thanks so much, Matt. My for pleasure. more information, visit markamandy.com. Thanks for watching The Mark and Mandy Show. Like our video by clicking below and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also connect with us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram.